welcome back to my youtube channel what is up what they motherfucking do twisty twist or whatever and yeah if you haven't already please make sure you like this video comment down below tell me some video ideas because i have no idea what to do <laughs> i figured that i would get to know you guys excuse you i'm making a youtube video i swear he always talks in the background just so y'all know that he is there like he literally never talks at all that loud until I start filming TikTok videos, YouTube videos, like okay, calm down. What have y'all been up to? There's a lot I want to catch y'all up on, but I'll save that for another day. But in this video, I'm just going to do a little get to know me challenge. Nathaniel and I did do this challenge whenever we were living in our apartment three years ago. So a lot has changed. And since this is now my channel, I wanted to do the challenge again. But obviously it will have different answers, you know what I'm saying. So let me just sit down in the bathroom and do this TMI tag. Oh my god, I haven't been on the thing that's going in a hot minute. I would go through it, but it's getting insecure. I'm not gonna go through it because God only knows what I'll find. Y'all, my mother-in-law got my nails done and it's me Mira, they look so good. Look at the rainstorms. I'm not a girly girl, but if glitter was a color, bitch, that'd be my favorite color. Alrighty, let's get it. This is like 50 questions, so bada boom, bada bang, baby. Like, if y'all hear the toilet, I do apologize in advance, but I do got a little dumpy, okay? I got a little dumpy. So you might hear like the toilet seat like venting in, but whatever. All right, number one, what are you wearing? Beach, I'm wearing. This used to come with a pair of shorts, but I don't know if I donated them or what, but I cannot find them anywhere. So I paired them with these, like, oh my God, you guys can't even see. I paired them with these brown joggers. Y'all get the message. I'm not about to bust my ass trying to show you what I'm wearing. But y'all get the, y'all get the mem, get the mem. Y'all get the memo. Dude, the shit sounds horrible. Let me get a chair. I did it last time. This is a lot better. Oh shoot, let me raise y'all down. Y'all are too high. That's a little intimidating. All right, so that's what I'm wearing. Number two, ever been in love? I've been in love. Let me see. There was that guy. I would say I've been in love three times. Three. Is that bad to say? I've come to realization that people were not a loss, okay? I just had attachment issues. <laughs> so three times I've been in love. Number three, ever had a terrible breakup? Bitch, who hasn't had a terrible breakup? <sighs> Like, when I say that I've been in love, the first guy that I ever fell in love with, that was not even a freaking relationship, bro. Like, literally, it was just him dragging me along up until 2017 in September, and we had closure, and that's what it took for my ass to move on, because anybody that knows me personally knows there was this one person that I was mildly obsessed with. I don't even know what for. Like, I look at pictures of him and I'm like, bitch, what were you thinking? Because <laughs> this, uh-uh. Number four, how tall are you? Bitch, I'm five four. I feel tall. Number five, how much do you weigh? I'm going to skip that question. Because, <laughs> bitch, I want to go on a weight loss journey, okay? Like, ever since I have this baby, mm, Last time I was weighed, I was 153, and let's just say I was 123 when Nathaniel and I got together, 
he boosted my big behind up to 166 or I think it was 167 and then pregnancy made me go all the way to 201 bitch it was an unfortunate series of events okay any tattoos yes so this was number one this was number two number three number four five a little dog paw because when we got my dog cremated they sent us this card in the mail with her ashes and they put her paw print on there and that's like her paw print and then this is number six this is my recent one it's dedicated to put all of you it's her footprints and then there's a elephant with a mama elephant with a baby elephant and i love how he like did it in a way where it looks like the palm tree is a part of it and then this is like her birth flower wrapped around it she's a gemini so it's lavender and then there's a roman numeral clock that says the time she was born 10 52 a.m and then her first and middle name so yeah that's my tattoo stay tuned for some more because I'm getting one on my spine and I know that shit's gonna hurt like a beam. All right, any piercings? I have my ears pierced. I don't really wear earrings like that. I really need to get on the ball game of that because I'm a girl. Like, I gotta look like a girl. My old best friend pierced my nose and I have my tongue done. I love my tongue ring. It's so funny because like now I love it, but when I had it done, bitch, I was ready to take it out by the fifth day. Like that shit's killing me. I'll insert a picture right here of when I got a pierce. Like my tongue was so swollen. All right, OTP, what does that mean? I don't know what that means. On the phone. Favorite show? I really don't know. What have I been watching? I've just been watching like throwback shows. Like we've been watching like Sweet Life on Deck. And Hannah Montana and Drake and Chai. I've been liking trash TV lately. I would say my favorite show now is like Love After Lockup or Maggie Day Fiance. Favorite bands? The only thing that comes to mind is like Queen. Like if you can recite Bohemian Rhapsody with me, you are my favorite person automatically like off rip. Something I miss. I miss a lot of things. But one thing in particular would have to be I uh, miss when my baby was a newborn. I love seeing her grow, but oh my god, like I feel like like it's so crazy because I look back at pictures and videos of when she was born and there's some videos and pictures that I see and I do not remember filming them. Like I feel like I was so mentally checked out from postpartum and I got baby blues really bad and like right now I'm convinced I have PVD. I don't want to speak into existence. I'm gonna find out next month if I do have it, but that's a whole other conversation. What is something that I miss? Um, I miss a lot, but I'm not gonna say everything on here because you never know who's watching. All right, next question. Why does this boy, like, look, he likes his phone like this. That makes me livid. Boy, put that shit on there. All right. Favorite song. Um, right now, my favorite song. This is going to sound so crazy because, like, you would think it'd be some mainstream song. But I've actually been like blasting gospel music lately and it's Believe For It by T.C. Linus, but it has to be the live version. Love that gospel song. How old am I? I am 24. I'm gonna be 25 on April 7th. 99, baby. I'm like a 90s baby, but like, zodiac sign. I'm an Aries. I'm an Aries. Ooh, I'm an Aries. I'm an Aries. 15. Quality you look for in a partner. I like me some beauty. Cause looks do matter. <laughs> Just kidding. Um I like somebody that can like pick my brain and educate me. Um I like somebody that makes me laugh. If you can make me laugh until I cry. I'm gonna catch feelings for you. Like, it's inevitable. Um, 
and somebody that is a hustler like i gotta get somebody that like loves to work like not so much love to work in the sense where we don't see each other as much but yeah and i also like somebody that can like spend quality time with me and do like occasionally like little acts of service like doing stuff without me asking you know favorite quote i want to give out my favorite quote but like i want to ask what's hot too i guess i'll just give this other quote that i like that i that stuck with me when I was in the psychiatric hospital says an ounce of prevention is a pound worth of cure and I'm gonna get that tatted right here I want it to be like right there that quote has really stuck with me favorite actor hmm. I have a favorite actress I love Melissa McCarthy and Amy Schumer they're like really funny favorite color baby blue hands down loud music or soft both of them depends on my mood where do you go when you're sad either the kitchen to cook and get myself some food to eat or in the bed so i can cry myself to sleep at night you know how long does it take you to shower to get through these coily curls every single time i shower i know i'm not supposed to wet my hair every single time i shower but I like it, it takes me about like maybe 15 20 minutes how long does it take for you to get ready in the morning bitch like five minutes I do my daily moisturizer spray my hair down slick it back do whatever and then just throw it out but I'm going and call it a day ever been in a physical fight bitch yes I can count on my hands how many physical fights I've been in it's actually pretty embarrassing and trashy but you gotta do what you gotta do turn on i'm like an educated man that's a turn on i don't like no man that spells our as r and i'm as am like baby boy if you got grammatical errors in your messages and you're in your mid-20s especially your 30s you need to go back to school like you need to do those little brain teaser tests to put your mind to work because you'd be so surprised like i don't know if it's just the county that i live in or if all men are like this but <laughs> like there's autocorrect and you're still spelling it wrong sir get yourself together oh my god my biggest turn on good hygiene if you smell good like you got on that cologne you got on that body wash and you brush your teeth every morning and every night and you do your hair <laughs> turn off bad hygiene bad hygiene the reason i joined youtube baby this has been my passion since i was like little little i think my first youtube video that i spewed out was like in the early 2000s nobody can find it though because my account get hacked let me see. Fears. Mm. I know if my brother watches this, he's gonna be like, girl, you gotta fear everything. But I feel like my fears are like human trafficking. Like I really wanna travel the world, but that's like the only thing holding me back. Last thing that made you cry. Me and the fans separating. Last time you said you loved someone earlier today I told my baby I loved her meaning behind my YouTube name is my first and my middle name voila <laughs> last book you read I'm currently reading take my hand and it's so good if you like historical nonfiction, that is your book I love it I got it from Target book you're currently reading take my hand I really need to finish it though because my sister and I want to start like this book club where like we read books and then like talk about it Last show I watched, Blippi. Blippi and Mika! <laughs> Last person you talked to, this lady that's like a mom to me. Shout out to you, Ida. I love you, baby. My mother for life.
my second mother for life. So mom, if you're watching this, don't get jealous. The relationship between you and the person you last have texted. She's like a second mom to me. Like this lady literally, she would put therapists out of business. Legitimately put therapists out of business. Favorite food. The old me would have said pasta, but I think my new favorite food is like tacos. I just love tacos. Or no, I lied. I love ramen media. So everybody's fantasizing over the tacos with the soup, like the consume. But bitch, get the ramen media. It is so fire. Like, oh, in case you want to visit. I want to visit a lot of places, but I feel like the main places that I want to visit is either the Maldives, Greece. But to keep the budget cheap, I would say Tennessee, because I really want to experience snow. But I don't want to go during Christmas because that's a whole tourist trap. And I don't like people like that. The last place you were. What's a that entail? The last place that I was. What do you mean? I don't understand. You have a crush. Last time you kissed somebody earlier today, my baby. The last time you were insulted when my daddy was about to stone me with a Bible in her room. Like, I feel like my grandma is getting to the age now where she says spiteful stuff without thinking twice about it. But I'm not gonna get into that because I know her sister be watching my videos. Hey girl. Favorite flavor of sweet Hershey's with almonds. <laughs> Hershey's with almonds or peanut butter. Why do I always say peanut butter? Peanut m &Ms. Okay. No. Actually, I have been addicted to s'mores lately. Like, I'll legit put a graham cracker with Hershey's and marshmallows in the microwave, and it's so good. Even though it makes my teeth hurt. What instruments do you play? Bitch, I play the flute. I can play some hot crud love. <laughs> I don't know. I want to learn how to play the drums because I need to let this frustration out, baby. Favorite piece of jewelry. I've been addicted to anklets lately, but if I do get pregnant again, if, if, I want to get like a belly band for my belly. Like, look at this pouch, bro. Look at this pouch. I want to get like a belly thingy, my barber. Sorry, y'all had to see that. My belly, ugh. Looks like a little oil milk from bar. As a sport you played. The swimming count. I guess the last legitimate play sport that I played was top golf for Nathaniel's birthday last year. Was it last year or when I was two years ago? I don't know. My song you sang. What song did I play last? It was probably some hood rat stuff because I get in my hood rat feelings sometimes. You want to touch? You want to you? You want to get it? Da, 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 da. Most of these be down. Favorite chat up line? Chat up line? What the heck? Chat up line? I'm going to just use pickup line. Baby girl. Put a phone in your back pocket because that ass is calling me. Boy, are you a parking ticket? Because you got fine written all over you. Is this seat taken? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Have you ever used it, bitch? Yes. I literally, like, even though I'm legally married, I'm the biggest flirt, and I really need to get out of that because I'll have so many men hitting me up, and I'll be like, dude, I want nothing to do with you. I'm a naturally flirtatious person. I think I get that from my father. <laughs> the last time you hung out with anyone, bitch, like, Father's Day at Volcano Bay. Or no. My brother came over the day before yesterday. No, it was Sunday. Today is Wednesday. Y'all are gonna see this video tomorrow. Who should answer these questions next? 
the world may never know because I have no YouTube friends. <laughs> Alrighty guys, that was all 50 questions. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a huge thumbs up. Also, subscribe and hit the bell icon so you guys can get notified every single time I post a new video. Love you guys with all my heart. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.